Barbara, Barbara Kieslinger from the Center for Social Innovation, which is located here in Vienna, in Austria. And we are one of the partners in the Make It project. We are coordinating some case studies to find, more, find out more about the maker movement, how their collaboration works, what kind of impact they are creating, and how they are structured and organized themselves. For me personally, I would say the collaborative part is very interesting because I've been working in e-learning for many years. So it's interesting to see how these rather loose structures collaborate in different ways online and offline and how this all merges together. So we don't make the distinction anymore between what is online, what is offline. It's just a normal way of interacting and of this community building. That's something specifically interesting for me. Also the personal networks and the establishment of, of social capital and on the other hand for our institution and also for, for our whole team the social impact that can be created uh, with this movement is very important and interesting because we study social innovation from many different points of views and so the make a movement is really something where there is great potential to have social impact and that's uh, what we want to study here and how far this is really uh, this movement is really transforming aspects of society the thing of having access to the to resources easily and creating your own thing and, and networking together from make it specifically i expect that we get better insights into how the maker movement is, is uh, organized, how they're working, what are trends coming out of it, and just, as I said, study in more details and find, get more findings of how this can impact uh, our social structures and how social innovation can be created.